Hey guys, it's Kurt, the original HCG Warrior here, and we're going to be talking about willpower today and um, the fact that willpower is not enough and how we can set ourselves up for success. Um, we really need to uh, focus on our environment because that controls us um, on a deeper level. You've probably heard the saying, you're a product of your environment. So when you surround yourselves with influences, you will become that. Um, and it's easy, easy to be taken over by your environment. So we control our environment. That's the easiest way to success. Instead of trying to force your way through with willpower, because um, willpower, it's not enough. So how do we set ourselves up? Well, uh, first things first, you get your spouse on board. Okay, you get your spouse or your roommates or whoever you have and you tell them, listen, we're doing this uh, or I'm doing this diet. You don't have to do it with me, but it'd be nice if you didn't, you know, eat ice cream in front of me and <laughs> chocolate cake and do the baking um, in the kitchen. Um, so get the person you're living with on board uh, to support you. That's step number one. Step two is get rid of all the junk food in your house, the chips, the chocolate, um, everything out of the fridge, the cupboards. Um, yeah, just get, get out of your house. It's one last thing. If you are an alcoholic and you're trying to quit alcohol, you're not going to have, you know, bottles of vodka just sitting there on the counter. It's just, it's just not conducive. So that's an obvious one. Um, number three is clear your schedule. This is the next level because... Um, what you do is you, what I do, what I did was, um, I didn't plan anything for the entire month. This entire month, um, was for dieting, was for the HCG diet. It, it was for me. It was for me to become the best me. So it's only 30 days, you know, so just block that off. It doesn't matter if your best friend has their birthday. Yeah, I said it. Best friend. And here's how I would handle that. I would I would call them up and say, Hey, Matt, guess what? Um, I'm doing a detox this month. I know it's your birthday coming up in two weeks. Um, shows that you, you actually remembered. You remember it's two weeks coming up. Um, since I'm not going to be able to make it to your party because of this detox, I'd like to take you out for dinner. Um, and in four weeks on a, that day, so July 31st. I'd like to take you out for dinner uh, and show you how much you mean to me uh, at that point. It, is that okay with you? And they're going to be uh, wowed first off that you remember their birthday probably. And, um, and if they're a good friend, they'll understand that you're taking time for you. Um, so that's a, that's a really good one. <clears throat> Book activities. Don't don't get bored in your house. That's the that's the that's when we go on autopilot and we go and we open the cupboards and we open the fridge. Oh, what can I eat to get high? Right? Because that's what it is. It's, we're we're filling, you know, some kind of need there. Um, so book activities. So what I did was uh, I went to comedy shows. I know there's drinking and food there, but it's not really uh, expected at comedy shows. So I would just get a water, my my um, wife would just get whatever. Um, but it was great. Comedy is a really good one. Um, yoga. Um, no, yoga is another one I did. Um, and watching, binge watching Netflix actually uh, kept me really busy. When I'm in the house. So when I'm in the house, that's what I do. But I try to get out of the house the best I can. And I highly recommend that one. Um, and meal prep. Meal preparation. That's a simple one. That's a part of the diet, I say. It's just go out and buy all your meat. Have the meat in the fridge or the freezer uh, ready to roll. Um, it's just one less hurdle, one less hassle. Uh, if you don't have the food made, it's kind of like, ugh. I could just grab that waffle or whatever is easy sitting there. So make the healthy food easy and accessible. Um, if you set your environment up like this, um, 
you're more likely to stick to the diet plan and stick to it. Um, now, if you want to use your willpower and actually go to the birthday party and go um, to that um, those events and and just not eat the junk food that's sitting in front of your face, um, that's great. That means you have strong willpower. You're capable of doing that. Um, there's ways to build your willpower, and, and I could talk about that in another video. Um, but these five things are the best way to set your environment up um, for your success on the HCG diet. So I hope you enjoy. Good luck, guys.